Hi there, welcome to the Currentware video tutorial series. In this video, we will teach you how to install the Currentware console, server, and client. Let's get started. First, download the latest Currentware setup file from our website. Click on the download button on the top right hand corner. Once you fill out the download form and click submit, the download will begin immediately. If you're using Google Chrome, your download will be located on the bottom left hand corner. Now it's time to install the Currentware server and console on your computer. Double click on the Currentware setup file from the zip file that you just downloaded. Click on the next button until you see the Currentware solution selection page. Select the solutions you want to install. Browse control is our web filter and browse reporter is our employee monitor. Let the installer continue with the installation. This process should take around 3 to 5 minutes to complete. Before deploying the Currentware client, you need to identify the computer name of your Currentware server. Let me show you how to do that. Open up your control panel and go into System. Your computer name is listed on the bottom section of this window. You will need to input this computer name during the Currentware client installation. For advanced user, you may also use the IP address of the Currentware server. Now it's time to install the Currentware client on your employee's computer. Double click on the CW client setup file from the zip file that you downloaded. Put in the computer name that you obtained earlier. You also have the option to change the default client password. The client installation will complete in a few minutes. If you have everything set up correctly, your employee's computer will show up on the current where console is connected. Congratulations! You can now begin managing your employee's computers using Currentware. This brings us to the end of this video tutorial. For more information on Currentware, feel free to contact us directly by email, phone, or visit our website. Thank you for your time.